So season four of The Boys has officially ended and did the season four finale live up to the high expectations? In my opinion, I believe it lived up to the expectations and I believe it even created some memorable scenes and moments because a lot of things happened in this episode that will shape season five. And it's a lot, I ain't even gonna lie. So I'm not gonna say it's in any particular order. This is not happening in the chronological episodes you know these scenes that i'm gonna say didn't happen back to back to back but the scenes that happened that were crazy was one <laughs> we see ashley and her superpower is that i don't know what her superpower is but it's like transforming her into this monster and it's kind of left ambiguous because we'll see what happens in the next season but her hair is falling off we see that she's convulsion her brain looks like it's breathing in my opinion so it's like damn that's crazy and what we see what will happen to her in season five will show us all of this this scene about annie i didn't like because when hubie was telling her about the doppelganger of annie in the last episode annie was trying to blame hubie saying like oh how many times did you sleep with her and hubie's like i mean it was 20 but i thought it was you you know so that's not hubie's fault that's a shapeshifter you know what i mean and Annie was trying to guilt trip him so I didn't like that scene of Annie I hope they kind of fix that but I ain't gonna lie I'm gonna have to spoil something real quick a death and that is Victoria Newman crazy because Butcher he has powers he has tentacle like things coming out of his chest and it's like what the fuck I thought his powers were like exploding people but nah this one was gruesome because Butcher turns on the whole gang and he's actually fully siding with Kessler so then everybody in the boys the whole team was around butcher in the warehouse and victoria newman so butcher now uses tentacles to try to grab victoria and then the daughter of victoria tried to stop butcher butcher instantly swats her away then butcher just rips her body in two and you see all her guts her intestines her lungs everything is spilling on the ground i'm like that's fucking crazy killing her at the end of the season means that homelander will get his way in the next season because we also saw before victoria's death homelander's a dickhead homelander literally heat visioned her while they were on live and victoria obviously is a soup she didn't feel it but homelander outed victoria newman in front of everybody bro i was like this nigga homelander is a dickhead for that bro that's crazy now we see a lot of the main characters getting kidnapped so kamiko and frenchy they were with each other but then these characters came and they were mind controlling frenchy at first frenchy was trying to save kamiko from being kidnapped but then they mind controlled him so frenchy now stopped and frenchy willingly walked inside the van to be kidnapped i was like damn that's crazy and it was even crazier because kamiko was screaming no the first time she willingly chose to speak she was screaming no but it was bad in a great way it was bad because frenchy his first time hearing kimiko's words was when he was mind controlled and that shit was actually emotional to me at least to me and then we now see annie her powers are finally back and she now soars into the sky when you know she sees that huey is getting kidnapped as well by these people huey got kidnapped so annie is like you know she can't do anything right now she now flies and her powers are back i'm like okay okay bet time in the next season is gonna be pretty crazy because i do believe that they're gonna do what they did in the comics and that's the only thing i liked about that god forsaken piece of shit comic that the boys is based on and it was that scene in the white house where all of the evil superheroes or super villains were flying above the white house i hope they redo that scene in the next season because homelander is about to be in office but one thing i kind of didn't like is that we didn't see a train but it made sense because a train he ran off in the last episode but i wish they would have kind of showed us where he ran to but i guess you know to probably leave that as a little spicy a little spicy spice you know on your food for the next season so we'll have to see what happens with that but yeah 
But this season four finale had a lot of things going on. It was crazy, unexpected deaths, unexpected scenes happening. I was like, damn. So I'm pretty sure President Homelander is gonna be a thing of reality in the next season, in the last season of The Boys. And one thing I will say before leaving is that I ain't gonna lie, Huey this season, it wasn't really used well. Like his only great scenes was when he was with his dad and when his dad turned to a superhero and unfortunately they had to kill his dad but when he got like basically raped or molested by tech knight and ashley and getting kind of raped again by the shapeshifter where she shapeshifted into annie uh, like huey wasn't really handled well but that's my only criticism of season four season four was a banger it had a lot of great scenes homelander was a highlight of this season again so this season was great but let's see what happens in the next season man but that's it that's the end of the video i'm out peace